seconds. How's it going? And a welcome back to another episode of Daily Faction. You guys smashed a like goal yesterday, and I super duper appreciate that. Let's see if we can smash another 2,000 likes for Daily Factions. That would be greatly appreciated, and it really helps me grow. And honestly, guys, just thank you so much for all the great comments. I've been just reading them all. They're just so positive lately. I'm loving it. <laughs> So, I logged on this morning, and I found this box at the edge of our walls. I was like, oh no, someone's setting up a cannon, and it's not claimed by anyone, so that's cool. Uh, which is weird, because it's a box and it's not claimed, I don't know why. We've got Rev, um, that have claims, we raided those before. We've got Lone Wolf, I think we raided them before, or they ruined one of our raids, and they're pretty much a big enemies of ours. We have a lot of claims popping up everywhere, and I just think it's time that we're gonna get raided. But pretty much, there was, I think it was a tunneler inside here. I'm not sure who actually stopped it, but pretty much, as you can see, they've actually tried to tunnel over towards the base. Uh, they actually got a good bit. But one of our faction members stopped them. I don't know who because they started to place it down obsidian and stuff. But as you can see, they tunneled quite a bit underneath the walls and kind of destroyed some of the walls. Which is kind of sad. They might have to be repaired. Who knows? But um, I say it could be time. This base could get raided. Once it starts getting a lot of attention, people want to raid it. And I'm very, very used to being targeted. So I'm kind of cool with that. But it got close. Like, they still had a good bit to go. But they got spotted, which is good. That's the first time we've actually stopped someone from raiding us this, this map. <laughs> But there's another very, very interesting thing that I found outside our walls. And let me show you. Like, this is becoming an absolute meme. Okay, so do another scan. Look who has claimed right here. Literally right here. The gods OG. I raided one of their small bases yesterday. Oh no, I could have angered someone. I have no idea. Yeah. So they claimed that side. That's another thing I wanted to show you, but I've just realized that the gods of G have claimed right there, and that's definitely, they want I probably can, that's definitely canning claims. Okay, so seriously, someone went through all the time and effort of doing this. Now you might think, this, like, yes, yeah, someone just put a bit of TNT down and blew it up. No, this is becoming an absolute meme because of Raven. Someone actually went through the bother of making a sign that says buy merch. Really? Really? <laughs> it's coming a complete meme. Every time I stream, everyone in the chat is like, buy merch because Raven's actually making them do it. Ah, oh, what a meme. I just love it though. When I actually, when I came over here, you know, you expect to see a cannon of some sort. This is not what you expect to find outside your base. You know, buy merch, you know? <laughs> this is not what you expect. But anyway, guys, I logged in today. I had two mystical charms, which I got myself. But then someone bought me a mass potion again. So thank you very, very much. Whoever did that, I really do appreciate that. And we're going to open it up in your honor. And hopefully we're going to get something good. I do want to get, I think it's a Psycho PvP anniversary mask. I think it just looks, I think Raven had it on recently. And it just looked really good. Like the purple particles I had coming off, it just looked really good. Okay, right, come on. Let's see what we're going to get. We're opening it up. Searching for a mask or forming a mask. Come on. Come on. And we got, hey, we got a TNT mask. Now, this thing's not that bad. Is it, is it, it, oh, it's common now. I remember back in the day, the TNT mask actually used to be rare, like really rare. But it's not as rare anymore. But it used to be really good for doing parkour around spawn when you couldn't fly. It's actually common now. Jeez. We actually have a lot of new masses, which I still haven't got because that's because I have terrible luck. But it's so much fun. Look, I can probably jump up here a bit. Come on, come on, come on. Blow up, blow up. Boom. I missed. Okay, but I could. You know, you get the picture. You can do parkour of it. <gasps> oh, oh my god. Holy smokes. I nearly, I, I nearly fell into the war zone there. That could have been embarrassing. A lot of people were waiting for me. I could have literally lost my stuff there, and I had mystical charms, but the TNT mask saved me. Thank the lord. Okay, let's PV that. Now, since it's common now, that means it probably doesn't sell for a lot, so, oh well. Oh, this guy wants a screeny. Of course, dude. Of course. But anyway, let's open up these two mystical charms, and maybe today will be the day we get the Anarchist rank. But who knows? It's down. It's purely luck. But, like, I've been opening a good few this map. Um, I haven't got as lucky. Some people have got super lucky. Some people have gotten their first try. I, I know someone very closely who got it the first try, Pluey. And I'm just so jealous of that. I'm so jelly of the fact that he got Anarchist first try. So jelly. Okay, let's open these up. Let's see what we get. And also... So I didn't actually have a raid today. Like, I was looking for a raid. Well, actually, what am I saying? I got lucky. Let's just say that. Because I, I didn't find any claim raids. And I kept looking. But I actually, I think I found a sky raid. There's glass. There's one bit of glass up in the sky. Which usually means, you know, sky raid or something like that. 
But it was nighttime, and I could see the glass so well. So I think we have a raid. I haven't actually fully checked it out because I wanted it to be a surprise. But I think we have a raid. And it's really lucky because I was looking for claim raids and I didn't find anything good. I found a base worth like 4 million. That wasn't worth it. Anyway, let's open this up. Let's go from this one and then we'll go bottom one and then middle one. Okay, we got a kill tracker, which is good because we need to actually put that on our axe. Okay, let's go for this one as well. That's actually perfect. We can stick that on our battle axe. I hope we don't lose this battle axe soon. But, like, you know what I mean? Some people get battle axe or divine items or just good items in general. And they don't... <gasps> Oh my lordy, that would have been amazing. But what I was going to say is some people get battle axes and you know, good stuff in general. And they never they keep them in the PV until the end. But like, if you're not going to use it, what's the point of having it? Do you know what I mean? So I might as well use it for as long as possible. And when I lose it, I lose it. Someone else can enjoy the lovely divine axe. <laughs> okay, right. So we got a kill tracker. Let's just plop that straight on to our battle axe. Because why not? We do need that. We need to make this into a god axe very soon. But, like, literally every time I come online, it's either marks or skirt grinding blazes. So, I just haven't got a chance to grind blazes at all. Okay. Last mystical charm. Let's do this. Bam. Come on. Come on. Please. I don't even know if I've even seen the anarchist fly by in a while. Okay. It's going to be <laughs> a legendary kit. No, I don't want that. 24 hoppers. Okay. That's all right. Well, it, yeah, it's uh, it's not the best thing anymore. But if that was starter map, that would have been deadly. And by the looks of it... No bonus reward. Nope. Did we get any bonus reward? Nope, we didn't. Okay. Ripperoni pepperonis. But we did get a kill tracker. So I guess that's decent. That saves us about 50,000 to 40,000 souls that we would need to grind to get one of those. But oh my god. Imagine if we got that divine sword. That was actually so close to getting it. That would have been sharp six and everything. Okay. So I saw this when it was actually nighttime. So if I look up now, it's actually really, really difficult to spot in the day. So if I was running past here and it was daytime, because I ran from this angle, chances are I would not have spotted that. Nah, that's that's impossible to nearly see. That is literally impossible. Yeah, that would be, that's actually really tough to actually see. Okay, F claim one, fly. All right, let's see what we got. Guys, this could be absolutely nothing at all. But obviously, the reason why I'm so confident that it is something is because if it was raided or if, you know what I mean? If it was raided, pretty much, there would be a tower going up to it. Do you know what I mean? Or it'd be claimed at least. But it's not. So let's see what we got here. Okay, well, there's definitely chests. Holy smokes, that is a tiny, tiny sky base. I don't even get. Look, why are, why is that glass there? Okay, do you think I can fly over that? I think I can make it if I just do it. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, I did it. I did it. Now, I'm confused now, okay? Because why is that bit of glass there? Because surely, you like, you don't even need the glass. You could just set your home sitting on top of a chest. I find that weird. I find that super weird. Okay, what have we got sitting inside the chest? Okay, I can't even open them here. Uh, we got prop four. Actually, a good amount of it. Holy smokes. Uh, more prop four, prop four, and I guess there was prop four in here. <laughs> it's literally a prop four vault. Okay, so what I'm going to do quickly is I might as well take it because why not? Like, it's literally prop four for doing zero work. So what I'm going to do is I'm literally going to, since it's all just raiding the same stuff, you can see, clearly see this is all prop four, a bit damaged. It's not full sets, which is kind of annoying me just a little bit. Like, okay, right here there is, but here, like, there's not, and that's kind of annoying me, but I'm still going to take it. But what I'm going to do is I'm literally going to move all of this out really, really quickly. Is there any, like, custom enchant, like, tools? No? No, I don't think so. Okay, so we'll literally, I'll be, like, 10 seconds. Okay, so all the prop four is ready. I literally took everything from the space, because, like, you know what I mean? Why not? And now, what we're going to do is we're going to do something very cheeky that I do all the time. We're going to bust this, and we're going to bust this, too, if we can. And we're going to go back to the base and get all the sponge that we raided the other day. So when this person logs on, he's most likely going to, if he doesn't have a chicken mask, fall to his death. Okay, hopefully this will do nicely. Um, Actually, I think we're going to need way more sponge than this. Yeah, we might need way more sponge than this, I'll be honest. Oh, well, look, I can just recycle it. It's perfect. <laughs> We just gotta hope that this guy comes back, and when he does, he just doesn't think that his base has been raided and he just falls to his death. Because I'm not clearing out this whole ocean area, because that could take ages. <laughs> okay, so apparently, um, I'm actually gonna F, uh, F unclaim over here, actually, because I want to keep this random claim. But apparently, uh, Pluey needs help um, trenching for a can. So we're gonna go help him. Now, I'm not sure if we're gonna be raiding this like episode or not, because it, it could take 
hours and hours. But we'll go over it and see what they're up to. And who knows, you might actually see it happening next episode. So let's TP the Pluey. I, I don't think it's a trap. <laughs> I don't think so. Okay, actually, never mind. Pluey seems to be offline. So maybe the raid isn't going ahead. I have no idea. Apparently, we have a new FOM, which I, I haven't heard of. But I think a scammer said TP there. Or like there's a new uh, FOM being made or something. Okay, well, I think they want to help digging out. We're done trenching now. All right, okay. Whew. I got a little bit nervous. I was just literally asking today for a silverfish mask uh, to help. And then the second I did that, they all started equipping like horse elements. It's like, oh no, like, oh no. Like, literally, I'm definitely trapped in here with my god set. Like, I'll be so dead. But I think we're cool. Sorry. Okay, I'm late. I'm late. I'm late to helping. Sorry. <laughs> At least I tried. I was coming to help. Ripperoni pepperonis. But I got so scared. I was like, oh no. This is it. This is the end. Now, apparently, okay, so I literally moved out of the vault now there was still a bit of tnt inside there and a few like general like you know chicken spawners and stuff but i never moved it out because i was literally keeping it there for as long as possible i was literally keeping it as the far far backup vault even though i knew it was time to get raided because it's been up for the last like month now and um, but like i have a backup pv here but then i had the backup vault remember my unclaimed lava vault apparently i'm getting a lot of spam saying that's been raided now i'm not sure but we will go check it out. But I don't know if we should go check it out in this type of armor. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take all this off. And actually just going to get in plain regular armor. So even if they have trapped the area. The only thing I'm going to lose is like four gapples. And I'm not going to take a chicken mask or anything like that. So I'm just literally going to go check out the situation. Put anything valuable inside here. So pretty much when I die. The only thing I'm losing valuable like is my head. That's literally it. Okay, um, let's go there and figure out if this is a troll or is it true? I say it must be true. Yeah, the vault's been here for like a month. Yeah, okay, it's definitely true. Okay, F claim one. Ah, they didn't claim it. F claim two. Okay, so yeah, it is raided. Am I sad? No way at all. It lasted me a month. An unclaimed base lasted me a month nearly. Holy smokes. Base... You did well, sir. You did super well. I'm so proud of you, man. I'm so proud. <laughs> All I hope is that this base was actually found legit because I've already got one person who attempted to x-ray this. Remember, I called the hacker trying to x-ray my base. But like, yeah, I hope this was found legit. I'm sure it was. I'm sure it was. But then again, it isn't claimed. Oh, wait, dumb potato. Was it dumb potato? I wonder if it was dumb potato. They live close, apparently. So here, you can see that they dug down. Okay, let's go. Let's follow the... Let's follow where they dug down and how they found it. But, like, this base lasted so long. I'm actually so proud of it. Like, it's actually making me... Oh, wait, 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 wait. That's weird. Okay, and then suddenly the cobblestone ends here. But it's making me want to build another one. The fact that it lasted so long. Oh, we found a cobble again. I want to know who raided it, though. Like, everyone's just saying, like, oh, it got raided. But, like, I'm not hearing of anyone who actually raided it. Okay, so there's the hole. So just let you go straight down there. I don't know. Who raided it? I want to know. <laughs> I was hoping for a big epic fight. This base deserves a big epic fight. Pluey said it looks x-rayed, but yeah, it could it could have been world downloaded. Who knows? Doesn't matter. At the end of the day, it lasted so long. It doesn't matter if it's x-rayed or rated legit. Who knows? But like, it just, it lasted. And I'm just, I'm so, uh, when we built it, I just didn't expect, I wonder, actually, I wonder if Raven's little unclaimed little vault is rated actually yet. Because his ones is like dispensers only. Ah, okay. So Myth are saying thanks for the TNT. So they're saying they did it. Hosting parkour at warp event. Let's go. <laughs> I want to do parkour hardcore parkour But anyway, yeah, the base lasted a month GG to myth if they did rate it They rated my backup items, but it's cool. I'll make another vault store some stuff there I hope that lasts as a month as well, but like that's too good to be true Like seriously that base was one in a million. I'll never get it back <laughs> But let's do some hardcore parkour. I'm so terrible to parkour watch me lose this event Like I'm gonna lose this event so bad I'm just, I just wish I was better at parkour. <laughs> so apparently, if you don't know what this is, pretty much we have to cross over here and then cross back and then like pretty much last man standing going across the park parkour wins, I think. Oh, come on. That's an easy parkour now. I won't be able to look. If I fall through that one, that that's terrible. What I'll do is I'll let everyone like scooch off because if, if not, it's going to be very confusing because literally you're just inside people. So it's just really confusing. So I'll let them all run first, then I'll go. Okay, let's do this. Um, I'm just afraid that someone's gonna stand in my way and I'm gonna fall right through. Like, when people are running through you, it gets disorientating. 
Oh, I'm so good. Oh my god, please don't fall through. Everyone's watching me. This would be totally embarrassing and I would like literally, yeah, that'd be embarrassing. Hey, I made it across level one. Now I've got nothing. As, did anyone see like people failed level one? That could be me down there. That could be me. Look, he's trying to end the pearl up. <laughs> Cheater. It's just that if it gets to fences, I cannot parkour on fences to save my life. Okay, what's this now? I can't see. I literally cannot see. I need everyone to go across. Don't fall. If I fall, there's going to be so many L's in chat. Okay, bam, bam. I can do this. This is easy peasy. Like, you know what I mean? I, I, I play Minecraft. I can do this. I can do this. Look at me go. Look at me go. Hardcore parkour. Okay, bam. Do you know, it, it, by the way, guys, this is not just a normal event. If we win this, we could get like a sharp six. So it, it's good to win these things. Oh, Ripperoni. Oh, pandas fell. Anyone I know? Skirt fell. Actually, quite a few people fell. Okay, I can't see. Okay, come on, guys. Go, go, go. Move it, move it. Okay, um, right. I'm just want to... I can't... Okay, right, there we go. I can see now. Come on, keep going, buddy. Keep going. This parkour is easy, you know? I need more... I need more spice in my life. Bam. 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 Oh, yeah. Level three. I'm on level three. I made it across. I am a hardcore parkour pro. Okay, what have we got here? Okay, we got slimes. Are they hard to park? Oh, no, we lost someone. Okay, come on, come on. Okay, these are a lot harder to park. Oh, my God. These are... Oh, my lordy. These are awkward. Oh, my God. Yeah, slimes. These are... These things are a pain. Holy smokes. Oh, no. <laughs> Oh, okay, right, this is, this is... It's really weird. It's like, re like one second you're going really slow, and the next one you kind of go flying. Huh? And then you bounce as well. <laughs> this is making me nervous, man. This is making me super nervous. I think we're going to lose a lot of people here. I'm not going down. Okay, come on. Come on, keep guys. Keep on moving. Keep on moving. You can do it. You can do it, guys. Oh. Oh. Oh, I did it. <laughs> I'm terrible at parkour. Like, I'm so terrible. Oh, my God. There's actually quite a few people disappearing. Like, it's not as busy as it used to be. Look at all the people outside. But, like, there's actually quite a lot of people gone missing. Let's just say that. <laughs> oh my god, I can win here. Nah, nah, that's too- that's asking for too much. Okay, please don't be fences. Please no fences. Please no fences. Don't be fences. If it's fences, I'm gone. I'm a goner. Oh no, it's fences. I cannot parkour fences. Like, maybe I can with this one, but like, it, I'm so terrible. Okay, just aim for the middle bit. Aim- it's easy. It's easy. Super, super easy. This is easy. This is easy. I've got this. I've got this all down. Okay, I'm low-key sweating right now. Holy smokes. Okay, just gotta just gotta make it over. Come on, buddy. Move off. There we go. That's it. That's it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yes! There we go! <laughs> I'm so terrible! But I'm doing it! How am I still on it? How am I still on it? Okay. Now, now, next time, it's gonna be fences now, but it's gonna be... It's gonna get super hard. Like, it's gonna get, like... You're gonna have to jump over to a fence, like, from a long distance. I know it. I can just see it coming. Now that the fences are in play, there's gonna be more fences. Okay. Right. So, how do I do this? Huh. Okay. There we go. Huh. Huh. I could do this. I think you don't have to jump on fences as much here. You can kind of... Come on, keep going, buddy. Keep going. Oh, oh, oh no! I, oh, no! Literally, as I was jumping across, someone kind of entered my screen. I couldn't see where I was jumping. No! No, I'm so sad. I was doing so much hardcore parkour. Ripperoni pepperonis. But, guys, I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you very much for watching. We raided the base. Our base to end 10 minutes later after raiding that base. Got raided. Well, our backup vault now. It was our base recently, but then our backup vault got raided. So, Ripperoni Pepperonis. We lost our backup stuff, and now we need to make another one. So, if you guys have any cool designs for, like, a backup vault or anything like that, like, any just cool designs on how maybe to hide it from X-rays, maybe do a different tactic instead of using lava, please let me know. But anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you guys in next.